Hi there guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are all doing really well today. Shock horror, we are back for another Sheen haul. You know that I am absolutely addicted by this point. And if you have seen any of my Sheen hauls before, you will know that this is about to be the most random haul that you have ever seen because I go through all the different categories on the Sheen app. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just a bit obsessed. So it has came in two packages today. So I thought we would start off with the smaller of the two. So the first thing in this package is oh no so i had picked up some coat hooks we are still in the process of doing our bathroom and the hooks that were left from the pre previous owner look like something in a school a primary school's cloakroom um so i really needed to change those and so i had seen these on sheen and I thought, oh my god, yeah, they're perfect. Because this is the colour, the style, the shape. This is kind of exactly what I wanted. Um, but I don't think I'm going to hang much at all on those. So I have absolutely done myself over at the first hurdle because I should have looked at the measurements to realise that these were tiny. Um yeah that's my own fault really so if you are ordering on sheen and timu's another one that's very similar make sure you are looking at the sizes because i'm not going to be able to hang anything on these coat hooks um great start to the video let's move on okay i don't want to get this out of its package because there is a sticker over the seal of this package However, if you can see here, it is a gold and pearl chain. Now, it's not a necklace or any type of jewellery like that. Um, my mom has started a new job recently and she is laughing about the fact that she has to keep putting her glasses on and taking them off and putting them on and taking them off depending on what she's trying to read, how far away she's trying to read it and all these different kind of things. So we had a bit of a joke that she needed one of the chains to attach to her glasses so she can just drop them off her face and they will just hang like a necklace on her chest. Um, so we were having a bit of a joke about that and it is her birthday in a couple of weeks time it will by the time this video comes out it will have already been her birthday because i would not want her to see any of her presents even if they are the little jokey presents um but yeah so this is going to be a little jokey present for her birthday and she might use it she might not but it's just a bit of a joke between us i do feel like i ordered two of those i think this is the other one that i have ordered so again it is a little glasses strap make sure i don't lose any of the bits i mean if you are looking for a glasses strap i do feel like these are really pretty um so you have the clasp like that on one end well on each end of the strap it then will connect to a little rubber piece like this so the clasp will go on the one end and then in the rubber it's like stretchy so you would stretch that over the end of your glasses sticks prongs the bit that goes over your ears you would stretch it over that and then you have connected it all around your head to wear on your chest like this and i do think that this is generally something that is 
associated with old people and grannies um, but this is a really pretty design so you've got the chains and then every now and then you have the little balls on there as well and so I do think that as far as glasses chains go this is a really pretty option so even though it is a bit of a joke present again for my mom's birthday if she wanted to wear it I think it would look quite good okay next up we have some clothing so this is again holiday summer it is literally all that I am thinking about at the moment um but it is these patterned elasticated waist shorts which are a really lightweight material so perfect for holiday perfect for hotter days in the UK and I think that this is a really nice pattern I think it is just abstract but I can almost see like a uh, palm leaves pattern in this as well um I could just be absolutely losing it there is a tie detail on the front there it is just a detail because it is an elasticated waistband and not a tied waistband but I think with a white or black vest top this is a very easy hot day holiday outfit what on earth is this right I think we're gonna have to come back to whatever is in the pink packaging because I'm gonna need a pair of scissors for those so next up I have got an LED video light so this is literally wow it's bigger than I expected but this is something that can quite easily clip to anything really it could be your camera it could be your phone um, there's loads of different options as to how you can clip this and where you might want to clip this is that actually screwing on ah now it is so like I say this is just like ah here we go so it is a giant clip which you screw the LED light to and I don't think it feels like there's, no, there's no batteries in there so I will have to get some batteries. Initially, like if I hold this next to my head, it's bigger than I expected. I thought it was going to be like this tiny little thing but so yeah that could work quite well next is a purchase for the pooch so this isn't actually needed as much now that the clocks have changed and in the UK it is light until well into the evening now but oh oh okay I see so I need to pull the tab out of there this is a dog collar and if I press the button that is amazing and then the where the button is just kind of slips back into the collar there as well but how cool is that so if you are doing a late night dog walk and it is dark obviously you need to keep your dogs protected and I just think this is amazing this is so cool you've got a slow flash and then you've just got constantly on as well Sorry, I got really distracted there. It is so windy today and the bathroom door had shut because of the wind um, and then it was making some really weird noises. It kind of sounded like there was somebody in the house. So I did panic just a little bit, but completely false alarm, it was the wind. So we are back talking about the dog lead. Um, what was I saying? Yes, it doesn't look like there is any option to change the batteries or charge it up. So it does seem like a one-time use 
thing but it was like two pounds so then realistically I do not mind repurchasing this every time it dies considering it is so cheap oh my god I forgot I ordered this so I have seen this everywhere and I have decided that I would like to save some more of my money and if it is in my account that is not the best place for it to be so if I am pulling it out of my account and putting it into this folder it does not show up as a number in my bank I will not spend it because to me physical money is like fake money so if it is not shown as a number in my bank account I, I don't have that money is how I view it so it is it kind of smells but I'm hoping that will wear off over time so this is the 100 envelope savings challenge and so then you have the challenge here and you can cross off all of the different amounts that you put in and once you have finished the whole thing it says dollars but obviously we will be talking pounds here so we will have five thousand and fifty pounds at the end of this challenge so I will have to put these into the folder but if I just get one out to show you guys so obviously this is the first day you've got what well first four days you've got one two three and four and so you will fill them up with one pound two pounds three pounds and four pounds and so on until you get all the way through to number 100 and then like I say you will have over five thousand pounds in savings just by doing this little trick so I do feel like this will really work for me and I'm really excited to give it a really good go I really want to do this well so yeah I'm excited to take on this little savings challenge right the last two pieces need a pair of scissors I will be back I've picked up some scissors I have opened the last two parcels off of camera but I have not looked at them yet so let's do this together oh gosh I hate hate oh I hate polystyrene so much but it has protected this gorgeous little trinket dish it has a lovely scalloped edge it has like a petal texture on there if you can see and then it has a bit of a coloured edge to give it that almost like distressed look almost but I think this is stunning I am so happy with this little dish the reason that I've brought this is not actually for trinkets like rings we have a cabinet right by our front door and we always just place on top the treats that we are going to take for bingo's walk um, and then you just end up with crumbs all over the countertop of the cabinet so I just wanted a little dish to be able to keep his treats in um, so that when we are taking him out we can just you know grab some treats pop them in our pocket whatever we need to do with them um but yeah I just thought that this was really pretty and this was only like two pounds fifty and then finally we have more polystyrene great okay so in the polystyrene oh no it's scratched I was about to say how amazed I am that a mirror has made it in the post because I'm sure that all their stuff comes from China I want to say so if this mirror has made it from China I am very impressed um but yeah it's this lovely oval shaped mirror with metal all around and then on the stand base there as well and I do think that this is really nice. I mean, to be honest, 
that scratch is annoying but when you are looking at the mirror as a whole you actually can't really see it that much yeah i'll just have to see how i go with that so basically i have ordered this mirror it was 10 pounds i think it was um for potentially to go on my makeup table i do already have oh gosh what an angle um i do already have a mirror on my beauty table but it is really really big and so i wanted to test out something small and cheap to work out whether i want the really big one or whether i want something smaller which will give me more tabletop space um so yeah that's why i chose to go with this one from sheen um but it is actually made really well and like i say i am really impressed that they have been able to package it in a way even though i hate polystyrene it has obviously done the job in keeping my mirror safe in transit so that is everything that I have picked up from Sheen today. I do hope that you have enjoyed this haul. If you have, then make sure to please give this video a thumbs up. And if you would like to see more of my videos, then make sure to hit that subscribe button as well. And I will see you guys in the next video.